Hi there, Darius here for The Chaos Group to take a look at the new max ray intensity feature, new in V-Ray 3.0. As you can see here in my VFB, I have loaded up my previous render, and you can see a number of very bright pixels, especially in this area. Now let's zoom into that area very quickly, and you'll see very clearly these pixels are quite blown out. These very bright pixels can happen when you are working with very bright sources, such as with some HDR lights, which is the case in this scene. Now in the past, you may have addressed these bright pixels by setting very high sample rates, clamping the output of the entire image, or even with subpixel mapping. However, with V-Ray 3.0, you can solve this quite simply with the new max ray intensity attribute that I can find here in the render settings window. Here in the V-Ray tab and under the Global Options, if I scroll down under the Ray Tracing heading, you can see Clamp Max Ray Intensity Attribute. Simply enable this attribute and you should have a much cleaner render. Now let's go ahead and specify a region here to re-render and we'll go ahead and see how the new clamping will work on getting rid of these very bright pixels. As you can see, V-Ray has gotten rid of those very bright pixels very quickly and easily without affecting the rest of the image. In other words, you're not clamping the intensity for the entire render. Because max ray intensity is clamping the secondary rays to fix the super bright pixels without losing the high dynamic range of the natural highlights in the render. Thanks for watching this video and be sure to check out our other videos on V-Ray 3.0.